Friends and family also gathered today to honor a Bel Air High School senior who was killed on campus this past Tuesday. 19 year old Cesar Cortez was a member of the junior ROTC and had already enlisted in the Army. David Gonzalez is hearing from those who attended the service at West University Baptist Church. Hey, David. Ron, yeah, a lot of people are still trying to cope with what happened to Caesar exactly, but today was all about being there for those who knew him best. About an hour ago, Caesar's brother led pallbearers out of the church, and these pallbearers were made up of JROTC cadets and also friends as well. The casket was covered in handwritten messages from loved ones and also classmates. Inside, people described an overwhelming sense of sadness. Caesar's JROTC family presented an American flag to his loved ones according to a service program. And many of those who came to mourn knew Caesar personally, others felt the need to be there for his family and friends who are going through unimaginable pain. Everyone at Bel Air feels close to each other, you know. Like, I didn't know Caesar, but a lot of other people did, and we just wanted to support them so they could feel better because it's a, it's a tough time for them. As for Caesar's family, uh, the Caesar's death has spurred a lot of conversation as well, like improving school safety and Bel Air High School staff today say they want to rebuild on that trust that has been lost because of this tragedy. And as far as Caesar's family, those who have talked to him say that they're still in shock over this tragedy, but they're also trying to figure out ways to keep Caesar's legacy alive. Ron. And thoughts and prayers to him and his family. Thank you so much, David Gonzalez.